Hi, everyone. I, I got gum in my mouth. Um, we're going to go see some of the people of Crossroads and see if there are any fears that they have. Let's go find out. Come with me. Uh, you might notice that in the spirit of Braveheart, um, just, yeah, take a look. Take a look. All right, now quit being gratuitous. Now, we, uh, the name Ferguson actually is, is Scottish. So how fitting that I'm wearing a kilt. Hey, Darren. Let me, oh, I, I'm not sure I can get down like that. Is that, is that appropriate? <laughs> Hang on. All right. We're asking, we're asking everyone here tonight yeah. if there is yeah. anything that you are afraid of. <laughs> Pastor Ed's jokes. Are you afraid of anything? Wow. Um... I'd have to think about it, but yeah, I'm sure I'm afraid of something. Okay, we want something spicy, something <laughs> scary. How are you doing tonight? Good, how are you? Good, I'm wearing my kilt. It's very fashionable. Thanks. I like can Thanks. I get one? You can have this. <laughs> Is there something specifically that you are afraid of? Teenage daughters. Teenage daughters, ladies and gentlemen. Is there? Oh, here we go, here we go. I have these dreams, <laughs> and I've had them since I was a little, little kid. And they're about miniature tornadoes. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> and they come and they pick me up and they lift me up into the sky. And I'm over my neighborhood as a kid. And I can see all my friends like playing basketball and like playing football. And I, it, it's freaky. It's way freaky. All right, little tornadoes. Uh... What am I scared of? What am I scared of? Uh, rhubarb pie, guacamole. Never had that. Not a guacamole fan. So, well, there's there's a difference between dislikes and fears. <laughs> well, I don't know. I think rhubarb pie. That's a fear. I'm afraid of being alone. The fear of loneliness. I'm afraid of spiders. I'm afraid of men in kilts. <laughs> Gosh, fears of. Um, Oh, Mike. Um. Michelle. Michelle Prater. Um, first of all, just for the record, and anyone is wondering, we're actually not married. People have been saying that. We're not married. We, we have an interesting connection in that our sisters both dated the same guy at prom. Not the same prom. But um, we'd like to know if you are afraid of anything. Other than you right now, no. I'm doing okay. You're kind of creeping me out. All right, well, okay. Is there anything in your life that you are afraid of? And don't use the joke of me, because everyone's been using that tonight. Is there anything, besides a man in a kilt, is there something that you have, like a fear, like a childhood fear that's still with you? Like, like I don't know. Elaborate. Uh, I'm not really sure. I guess, I guess I would have to say my dad, because he has that... Uh, that old, that old man strength, so. All right. <laughs> a parental fear. Okay, we're going we're gonna to use that in your therapy sessions. I'm afraid of strange men in kilts. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a winner tonight, folks. My mother sometimes. That's it. <laughs> we have a parental theme going on tonight. The unknown. No, I don't know. A fear of the unknown. That's a... Um, a bad answer. Not, well, I don't know. Is it? Give me something palpable. The unknown is is very abstract. Just the the fear of children and just wanting them to. Okay, my son in college, getting through college. That is my fear. But with faith in the Lord, I pray for him all the time. So that will wipe away my fear. That's the only thing I could think of. <laughs> We have someone come back for seconds. Pam Summit. Bugs. Big bugs. The ones that squish when you step on them. Don't like those. They're not popular. That they grow up with a strong Christian foundation. That what you give them in life is going to be enough. I'm glad you clarified. I didn't know where you are going with that. I'm afraid of that my older children, who are kind of prodigal right now, won't come back to the Lord. Hey, Deanna, Deanna, Deanna. Hi, Deanna. Hey, Deanna. 
we have a very serious question for you. We're asking everyone tonight, I want you to think long and hard about this, but not too long because i got to get to other people. But is there anything that you are afraid of? Speaking in front of people. Public speaking. It is the number one fear next to the lights being turned out, I think. I'm afraid of a lot of things, I guess. You know, one fear would be my kids not knowing God. Hello. <laughs> it's my good side. Yeah. Uh, we have a question for you, Diane. Is there anything that you are afraid of? You know, I've heard you ask that, and you'd think I've had an answer right off. I used to hate, I used to be claustrophobic. Okay. Claustrophobic. So, like, playing football, you know, or something like that? Tell me, would, you know, I was totally fearful of a pylon, you know, like, being crushed. Yeah? So, yeah. It, it's brutal if that ever happens. Yeah, I, I never played sports in that degree, but occasionally they, I, I would... People would pile up on me and beat me. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah. But enough about my family. <laughs> Anything that would uh, cut me off from my Lord. Being alone. Being alone. Or falling off a bridge in a car. Wow, what was the last one? Falling off a bridge in a car or having a bridge break really freaks me out. These are real fears. Auto-related, albeit. How much weight I'll gain if I eat this whole thing? <laughs> okay. I really don't like tornadoes. How about that? I was in one when I was little. I was hiking with Girl Scouts. And we literally had to get in the gutter of a farm road, you know. And the water all filled up and we had to lay there until the tornado went past us. So I've been afraid of them kind of ever since. You've been afraid of tornadoes since you were little. Brian over there is afraid of little tornadoes. What is everyone afraid of? Being alone. I'm afraid of a lot of things. That's juicy. That's spicy. <laughs> Tell me more. <laughs> As I reflect on tonight, probably the thing I'm most afraid of is that people are going to be too afraid to show up and to show up when it counts. No, you can't borrow my kilt for the homecoming dance. Can you tell me anything specifically that you are afraid of? Um, I guess the fact that I can't dance. Is it that you can't dance, or I won't dance, or I don't dance? It's I can't dance. If I can do this, then you can do... Yeah! Keeping it real. Appreciate it, sir. We're going on. Are you afraid of anything? I'll start with you. Um, yeah, but I'm too afraid to say it. It's that scary. Whisper it to me. Centipedes! <laughs> That's legitimate. I'll give you that. True that. What are you afraid of? I'm afraid of raccoons. They're really murderous, I think. <laughs> Did you see Over the Hedge? No. Bruce Willis was awesome, and he wasn't scary. Who's that? It's the next generation, folks. Spiders, bees, and snakes. Oh, my. I, I would say not, not being close to God uh, in times of weakness. I think that's... Uh, that's, that's what scares me, knowing that God's there. Oh, I'm afraid of a lot of things. <laughs> that I'm doing a good enough job raising three daughters in this day and age. I guess I have a fear that um, people's, people get the wrong idea about what this building campaign is about. And um, that it's really just about changing heart, your heart. And um, I want to see that building built for our future, for our kids, for a legacy. Awesome. And it's right over there. Do you see the lights? Look at the lights. That's it. It's real. I mean, it's not, it's the outline of it is real. That's where it's going to be. It's awesome. Men in kilts <sighs> that we won't be able to start on March 1st, building the new church. One thing, very seriously, I'm afraid of electricity going out in my home. I don't want my basement flooded. That's good. I've lived through that once, and it's not pretty. True that. Are you afraid of anything? No. That's awesome. <laughs> That's, I'm, God, I'm, God is on my side. Are you afraid of anything? Uh, spiders. I'm very afraid of spiders. Arachnophobia, ladies and gentlemen. Pastor Bill Spearman. Spiders. Sp S very popular. Arachnophobia. Bad. Bad. And not a good movie either. Are you afraid of anything besides me approaching you with a kilt? You know what? I'm, I'm not really afraid of much. Me strong like both. 